Hey guys, uh, I'm gonna show you a little tip, a little quick video how I take off the windshield wiper. I have a rusted, you know, that's been there for a while and it's rusted thing, hard to get off. I use a puller, puller like this, and at the end of it there was a plastic tip. It broke off. And it wasn't a good tip anyway, it would prevent it from sliding off. But uh, it's better use it without it, and I'll show you how to do it. So here I loosen up the bolts but I leave them you know I leave them on halfway you know like they loosen up they're spinning so now here there is a see now the tool will go in there it won't slide off the uh, this rod here because without it it will slide off this part here is supposed to be on top of this but when you twist it it slides off so just put this back on. Alright, keep it there. And then put this on. Yeah, and twist it. There you go. It's hard to do it with one hand, but yeah, it's positioned there. Now it's a little loose. Now we'll tighten this here. Make sure it's good. We'll press down. And now since the screw is there, it won't slide off. You just press it, twist it here. Twist, and then you go press on this elbow. So I'm gonna put the camera right here. So I could do it with two hands and you'll see it. There we go, it's off. There's a nut right here, it's all rusted. After a while, you know, it gets rusty. I'll just make another one of this one. Here it's a little tight spot. Over there it's a little tight. So what you want to do is these shocks here, these clips you gotta uh, hold on. Right there. These shocks here, these clips you pull them out, and on that side too, and you release the hood and raise it higher. Just put put something there so you have a more space here.
now the hood is raised higher now we have more space to turn that tool and have more room to work and right there it's off just like that So this puller, I got it from Equalizer. I had this for like six years and it's been used a lot. It works. All right, so this tool works great. Recommend buying it. There's a one with extra legs on it for a better grip. But this one sucks on a Audi's and Volkswagen. It's very tight, so I gotta get the other one. Uh, Definitely buy one so this way you don't break those windshield wipers. Because if you break one, it will cost you more than the whole job that you're making that money. Uh, so, thank you guys for watching. Thank you for subscribing. Comment if you have any more questions, please ask. And everybody have a good day. Thank you guys.